Poland, why you looks into space, you will never into. Uh, Germany, of course, trying to keep Poland down. Too bad you never meets of them, laughs Russia. Can't into space, can't into space. Poland getting bullied by both sides because someone may be out there who be like Poland is. Somewhere out there, haha. <laughs> Can't into planet. Let's make a planet only club. Pluto, you can't come. Pluto is irrelevant. Pluto and Poland, a match made in heaven. Hello, probings of Earth. I'd be very glad to meet you. Here's a satellite speeding by. Gotta go fast. Oh, okay. As he just speeds on by. I will be here if you want to visit again. Forever alone. It was pretty much that quick, right? Like just a couple seconds went by and boom. His only visitor in like millions of years. Mama, how was I get formed? Asked the moon. That's a long, sad story, little Luna. Tell me it anyway. I was a few billion years old. I was still young and hot-blooded. Still figuring things out. Oh, this is gonna be weird. I can already tell. He appeared at my whatever that point is. Science words. Small, dark, and mysterious. Wink. Oh, he's gonna crash into him. Oh. <gasps> He followed me around and around, chatting all the while. Thea was his name. I found out we had a lot in common. Against my better judgment, I was in love. We flirted with each other and with disaster. Boom! When we finally came together, it was explosive. I woke up the next day in a ring of debris. There was no sign. He was gone. <laughs> this, is, this is too good. Nine months later, you were formed. Not sure, like nine months. Maybe, maybe the moon was just dust at that point, revolving around Earth. Mama! Now all this time later, I still see a bit of him in you. And I like to think I keep part of him in my core for all time. Wow, that was a sad story. Yeah, and that's not even getting into how you ate your twin sisters in utero. I what? Oh, I think I did hear something about that. Weren't there two moons that had formed at first? Well, there were a bunch of clumps, and one clump took over. Wow, this is weird. Really eerily similar. Here's what the two might have looked like. An ancient planet busting onto Earth 4.5 years ago. Sorry, I shouldn't be saying the word busting. 4.5 million years ago. Ah, I didn't even realize that Earth actually has a Pangea right here. So this really was when the moon was nice and young. We have Earth Ball talking to Mars Ball. Hey, Mars, I finished sizing up Venus, and it's official. I'm the biggest terrestrial planet. You jealous? No. Ha 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 ha. Boasts the biggest of terrestrials. Might as well boasting about biggest of space dust. Jupiter biggest of all you put together. Am into biggest of solar system. Damn it. Ahem, says the sun. Get dabbed on Jupiter. Ah, uh, Andromeda. S ridic- Wait, why is he speaking in- Is he speaking in Latin? Here is our little sun. Wow, our sun is a joke. So these galaxies just laughing at our dumb solar system. Oh, are they coming together? No, no, no. It's gonna get bigger? Oh, no! My little brain can't take it! Oh, is this all of the observable universe? I've never felt like my life is more meaningless. We have Saturn. Where well, that's it. My mission's complete. Satellite once again abandoning a planet. I as guess you will go home now, but Saturn you are my home. Wait, wait, what? Zoom. It went inside of Saturn. Wait, wait a second. Again, this is getting weird. Please don't tell me we're shipping planets. I guess to understand this better, since we don't want to contaminate other planets unnecessarily, we like to crash our probes deliberately into gas giants rather than risk contaminating some of their moons. That still feels a little sketchy though for some reason. And this satellite was 19 years old. Still a teenager. Is not good. These ones are very noisy. Noisy. Sun can find out any moment. Well, what else can be done, Venus? At least now there is a chance for different outcome. Mars says, be careful. Are you freaking the kid me? Why is the sun speaking in broken English too? Oh, look, gotta go feed my moon. What? What I told you about keeping disgusting life forms was me last five times not clear enough. No, wait, this time it's different. These ones are smart now. I don't even know what we're talking about. They can think about themselves and work together to gather more knowledge. They're even making pretty pictures out of your heat patterns. Oh, they're talking about humans. Wow, I'm dumb. Okay. So Earth is defending humans, saying, hey, these are good life forms. Mm, questionable. And they've started traveling and sending probes everywhere. They gave Moon lots of nice flags. Oh, yeah, because our US flag is like torn up, right? Leave me out of this, Blas. If you give them enough time, they could do amazing. Th Am not care if they can prevent heat death of the universe. They are vermin and dirty and everything with disgusting organic matter. Why doesn't the sun like us? The sun must be a speciest. And for good measure, get the quasar beam this time. No, please, no. Shh, don't do the cry, Europa. Don't don't let sun see have liquid water. Oh, is that why we have liquid water? Because we're always crying. So when did you want to tell sun again that your moon l might have life? Oh yeah, Jupiter has possibly moon on Europa. Oh, they're talking about Europa. This, I see the moon. Boom. Ah! Uranus, if you ever say one thing to sun, I will hit you so hard your rotation axis become horizontal again. Okay, okay. Was just question. So sun found out Earth had life. He kaboomed us. And now one of Jupiter's moons might also need to be boomed. Annoying pigeon meme. Um, the moon just like traveling around us. It is kind of annoying the way it does that. <laughs> Internet. <laughs> what? 
It's chaos. Asteroids blowing things up. Incoherent screaming. That's all I see in this. Is it two Mars? Who's talking? Is this Venus and Mars talking to each other? It is so very dark on two. It is Venus, but look, Terra is shiny. Terra, very shiny. Let's ask why. Eh, that's Earth, I see. Wow, Terra, why two shine like that? It's because of the parasites that live inside me. Ooh, woo. <laughs> Wow, nice. Wish it was me. Wish they would come and live on me. Oh, they're jelly. Boom. And that's the downside of the parasites. Oh my, keep them away from me. Yeah, very shiny though. Don't try to pretend like the earth doesn't like when we boom it. You know it says harder, daddy. So I and Venus had this hilarious discussion about how fat Jupiter is and earth talking to the moon. Is Mars listening? Ah, uh, a chew? Blowing rockets at Mars face. Ew, are you all right, Mars? Sorry, I uh don't know. Dude, you're disgusting. When will you ever get rid of those parasites? Parasites on your planet. Oh, so that's just a common thing. That's what we refer to as. Eh, I'll be fine, Luna. A few hundred years later. So, uh, about those parasites. Freak off! Oh, Jupiter also finally heard the gossip. This makes me want to colonize Mars just, like, more aggressively. What a nice day to be a hydrant atom. These don't look like planets. Okay, hold on. Hello, 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 hello! Okay, more guys showing up. How are you guys? Guys, WTF, we're full. Sup, baby? Want to fuse with me into helium and release some energy? No, I don't want to! Is this nuclear or something? Are they making, like, nuclear stuff? Oh, helium has happened they fused okay then helium best gas come here baby let me hug you okay this is so weird why <laughs> now carbon starting to form carbon strong ah so much pressure i'm gonna fuse want to make lovings what boonga boonga let's <laughs> Ah! Okay, so now we have magnesium forming with neon and sodium. I really wish I didn't get a C in chemistry now. Let's go together. So everything is just packing in bigger and bigger. Oxygen's now forming. It's like a million degree sauna in here. We cool kids now. Silicon is the brown. All right, guys, let's think this through. We're full, crowded as freak, and around 3 million Celsius, wait, 3 billion Celsius degrees? We should be fine as long as you silicons don't dare to fuse into, well, freak. Remove energy. Energy is worse. Remove energy. Doctor, I think I ate something my core feels funny and I woke up as a red giant. Don't be the worry. Let me check if I can hear something in all iron. Uh, uh, all right. I guess they worship iron. Nickel strong too. Your core. Oh, red dwarf has become this. Oh, sh and now it blew up. What a pretty star. <laughs> all of that. <laughs> This is the perfect, like, summary. Wow, that's nice and bright. Fusion and digestion always goes bad. This me moon, Europa, Jupiter says to it. You going to mention other 78 moons? Nah, Jupiter don't care about them. Those are the unwanted children. Is my moons Phobos and Deimos? I am mispronouncing all this, I'm sorry. Here is Mars feeling proud. Earth, this is my moon moon. Because our moon is named moon. Hmm, this floor is made of floor. Hmm, yes, the floor is made of floor. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> what? Earth, I have no moons, and my moons have better names. Earth, I have so the many moons, and yet have never think to be that uncreative. I'm bad with names. <laughs> Isn't it Luna? We also call it Luna, right? Wait. Well... Not really. Meanwhile, in a parallel 2020, Doc says I'm clear, Mars. Besides making a very gassy and almost getting Luna infected, this WW3 medication really helped. I didn't even have to try those slow treatment no-no virus pills these cooks were babbling about. I mean, if those rats were that easy to extinguish, then why did they even have to exist in the first place? So Earth has finally gotten rid of its parasites, us, just having us blow each other up. It didn't even have to use the Kova. Then again, if we have nothing to perceive us, do we really even exist any more than a strange quirk in a quiet star's spectra does to alien onlookers? Wait, what? Oh, this is getting psychological. Earth is starting to break down. What are happening? That must have been the last organ- Oh, so we're extinct. Hold on, Earth. I'm scared. This is actually very what's happening it's getting dark Ugh. whoa this is getting oh it's over why this get so dark so because we got wiped out the solar system just like ceased to exist because like nobody was able to perceive it is this like along the lines of like if a tree falls in the forest with no one around doesn't make a sound this one's about a hypernova well these are it the last stages of my life so many million year wasted fusing at least m can live final years in peace yo dude you're gonna explode already is this all the planets watching the planets from this star that's about to go boom boom solar system yeah man explodey bang already where are explosion everyone's just getting ready <laughs> explode 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 are not explode yet damn use i'm only dimming dim 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 refund refund we want a refund this is some I'd be mad too. I got a front row seat to the best show in the universe. And it just ends like this. Testing habitability for parasites. Analyzing spectra. Analyzing host star. Okay, Earth on the computer. I haven't said that yet in my life. Habitable zone. Water. We have North America. Whoa, wait, wait. We're not supposed to be looking at 
his face. We're just look. This is weird. I forgot the continents are just like scars on his face. Hello, is this Mr. K218B? Also, Earth is calling up this possible habitable planet. Congratulations, you have won the raffle for um being the most charismatic planet ever. Come to the Soul System to claim your prize. Yes, really. Just come here absolutely ASAP to claim it right now, please. Why Earth use such old technologies? Is the moon trashing us for not using a cell phone or something? Uh, here's that planet, I guess. I mean, I totally woulds, but yeah, 124 million light years away. Aww. Hey, it looks cool though. Dang it! This is apparently referencing about a year ago when we discovered the first water detected in the atmosphere of a habitable zone planet. Not only was it within the habitable zone, but it also had water on it. And this fool doesn't want to claim his prize? I mean, I guess his prize would be parasite, so I get it. Earth, so you're telling me you guys only come in two sizes? Yes, a super massive black hole mass 1 million to 10 billion solar masses and a stellar black hole a collapsed star mass 5 to 100 solar masses then who are you guys intermediate mass black hole oh right in that in-between spot do the ed <laughs> they are look nothing like us don't know them so i guess not too long ago we also discovered the first intermediate mass black hole they probably knew it was there but they still had to find it first scientists detected first mid-sized black hole via gravitational waves we have a very angry rugged mars here finally it is of times there's his two little moons we shall conquer the solar system what are these asteroids uh oh we will strike many fear and horror into our enemies i am fear i am horror i will lead into you into victory where do you get the sword for i am the god of war mars is the name of the god of war in roman mythology so now prepare my loyal asteroids while i lead you oh this is their fellow army wow Look how epic he's looking and they're gonna go fight big gas jupiter nobody can fight the gas giants how do you eliminate gas giants actually is that is it even possible a mass probably just burn it up with the sun but yeah all of them are just gonna get sucked in and never seen again series orbit man series really do loving having water inside him such nice and watery apparently this is a dwarf planet that might possibly have water reservoirs inside of it i'm glad it's not pool on surface for stinky life like earth i guess he's saying he's glad he doesn't have oceans mars 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 is series hearing things do you have water by any chance chance no mars it looks like you have a polar ice cap right there hmm suspicious wait i have water and earth has want water can be will be relevant they just want to be relevant ahem <laughs> has what about now no <laughs> as they have rovers just like pecking them away oh they're all angry in the background i'm sad oh they're oh now no well that's a bummer i was sure he had some maybe i should send more probes oh hey how's the asteroid belts the hell's going on i don't even know what he's speaking huh whoa you could have told me you had water but it's very briny and scarce so it's not anything particularly significant oh well time to go bother europa i love how i'm already learning about important characters in the solar system they found out this dwarf planet might have global subsurface salty ocean that has been geologically active in the recent past yes yeah, fu should have spoke up a lot earlier ha 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 my power is increasing racing fast i'm still hungry what planet to be eating oh so this is a dark hole black hole interesting drawing of it uh is good choice will please of me greatly to make into demise pull and chilling here wow pretty <laughs> nice to see your cameo i knew we were gonna make a reference to pull and getting eaten here hey venus hmm what make it quick oh wow venus is a twitch streamer gotta donate do you ever wonder if there's someone out there exactly like you earth is a hundredth time you'd be asking that question Stop thinking so much about yourself. <gasps> Do I smell simp in here, Earth? No, I mean, completely the same as you. Everything is identical. The space around is so vast, for all we know, it could have infinite distance. Beep, beep. Who knows what could be out there in one of a trillion galaxies like our own. Every one of these is a galaxy except me. Okay. Meanwhile, millions of trillions of light years away. Identical. Don't have ridiculous. We're shipping planets. We're making them simp. We saw atoms making love. I don't even know where this is going to stop. Earth saying hi to their moon. Hello there, moon. The hello, Earth. Mars saying hi to his two moons. Big old Jupiter saying hi to their moon. Big old Jupiter saying hi to his moons. Dang, this one is scarred up. Actually, I guess all the moons are scarred up. Oh no, Jupiter, you, you forgot some. I Thebe not relevant as them also? What about us? Oh, all these. I was gonna say, like... Jupiter saying hi to their four moons? That doesn't sound right. Jupiter, you're forgetting all your children, especially the most important. S forward slash 2000 J11 question mark. Oh, also S2003. I do not know what worse, have millions of moons or have huge annoying sun. Is this Mercury? Dude, for a 500 years ago, Earth think he is blah, blah, blah. Oh, is this referencing? I didn't get that. Is this referencing Earth thought the universe revolved around him or something? Why have we not seen a comic about that? Earth being salty about that whole Earth-centric solar system theory. Black hole sucking up another massive ball. 
fault. No! This is evil, actually. Wow. That freaking black hole is gonna swallow us, says Earth. Please protect us, Mr. Sun. Okay, says the sun. I got you, kitties. Oh, no. Not like that. Not like that. They're gonna get big. We have the solar system, the sun, Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. Earth says, hey, Mars. Want to see something magnetizing? Okay. Hey, Venus. Ja. Want to see something cool? Okay. Wait, wait, wait. They're all turning into Earth. Something breathtaking? Want to see... Uh-oh. Oh, Mercury's not gonna fall for it. They don't want to become Earthified. Earth just oofed himself. Earth went kamikaze. Is this trying to say Mercury would rather burn up in the sun than become like Earth? Because that's depressing. Hello, Europa. Ho, ho, ho. I trick you. Wait, that's the EU. What's the EU doing in space? Oh, no. I suffocate. Classic EU move there. I believe we have the Martian surface. Meep, meep. Okay, is that a rover going by? My atmosphere feels so tingly. Analyzing. Ah! Earth. Venus, have you seen Earth? Nahem? No? Hmm. Oh, what is Venus hiding? Whew! I don't know how Venus survives in that. Copy both Mars 2020 vehicles. Continue operations. We'll need to cover a lot of ground and fast. This comic was made in honor of the Mars 2020 mission. Oh, it's actually going to touch down next month. Hey, Mars, I've been doing a survey. Want to participate? I'm not having any better thing to do. Okay, great. Question one. Do you have any life on you? Haha, <laughs> no, of course not. I not have life. It's silly. Ha, <laughs> sweats nervously. Hey, wait a minute. Is that? Oh, no. Liquid water. Very salty. You sh oh, the sweat gave him away. This is incredible. I've got to go tell Luna. I'll be back to investigate some more in like 10 to 12 years, okay? Okay. Oh, no, Mars. What? Mars? You hearing that? I not can keep you hide any longer is have 10 years to complete invasion missions and with no more. Understood. Finally, some aliens in this. Two asteroids talking to each other. Boring. Want to mess around with someone today? Sure, but who? Earth? Good idea. I never liked that guy anyways. Always spying on us. Yeah, give me a nudge. Boom. Bonks him into a different gravitational pool. Hmm. Let's see if anything interesting is happening. Oh, oh no. Ah! <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey! <gasps> Jupiter! I knew we were going to see this today. Jupiter's saving us. Looking to start something messing with my little buddy uh nah just just visiting doesn't matter anyways surprise gravity i knew about this for a long time i can't believe it's been this long since we actually saw a comic about it jupiter apparently saves us from a lot of asteroids thanks daddy jupiter and big thanks to the january patrons all in like stall arian after hours teaser 123 elijah senpai epi nick fusion wolf julius cheeser lennon lover 419 luxembourg lover mac manny manny 74 space period patrick c palofsky roll c tree stormtrooper 501 and clevin thank you link to the patreon is in the description down below